everybody. Happy Earth Day. Uh, my name is Lillian Calhoun and we are here on the flower farm in beautiful southern Doña Ana County. If you're tuning in from other states, just to give you a reference, we are in the southern part of New Mexico and our zone is zone 7. Um, and that means that we are in a beautiful warm climate and we get to grow almost all year round. We have an extended planting season. But today, what we're gonna focus on is planting teddy bear sunflowers. Woo! Teddy bears! Teddy bears! We love our teddy bears. <laughs> um, so if you have bought a kit that looks like this, uh, this is what you'll need. If you haven't bought a kit yet, no worries. Uh, we will post this video on Facebook and on YouTube so you can reference this at a later time and you can buy our kits on our website. Or if you don't have a kit, no worries. All you really need is dirt, seeds, and water, and a really enthusiastic, positive spirit. And you can grow whatever you have um, in, your, in your space. Okay, so let's get started. I'm gonna break into this kit. This is actually the first time I've ever opened one of our kits, which is very exciting. Um, so all of our kits are packaged in compostable material so um, you don't need to worry about any waste other than the labels everything is compostable and um, so there will be no waste in honor of our mother earth who we are celebrating today okay so in a kit you'll find an instruction card and a little thank you note because we are so grateful we have had such an enthusiastic response from all of you on our planting kit so thank you so much for your response um, you'll also find some plant markers. You'll find a few planting bags. So in most of our kits, there are three small biodegradable planting bags. That's what we'll start with. If you are one of our students tuning in and you got a student kit, you will have a bag that looks like this. You'll have one really big bag. So same amount of material, same amount of soil will go in, but you'll have one bag and everyone else smaller bags. What else is in this awesome kit? It feels like it's Christmas or Halloween and I'm unpacking my candy. <laughs> right. Um, you'll also find a card that has a code on the back and with that code you can get 10% off of any of our products sold online as well as our subscriptions which we will be rolling out very soon. All right. What else? We have a packet of kits. So each kit, um, I mean a package of kits, a package of seeds, um, and each kit has enough for two seeds per biodegradable pot. So you'll, we'll get back to those in a little bit. And last but not least, very important part of every kit and every planting process is the soil. So you have a compostable bag full of our soil mixture. In our soil, we do potting mix with, mixed with peat moss, vermiculite, and perlite. The perlite allows for some more drainage in your soil and the vermiculite also helps to control the moisture levels. It has this really beautiful quality where it soaks up moisture um, and it releases it as needed. Alright, so I'm just going to undo this bag and let's get started. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take one of your grow bags Everybody see? 
see me hi so here's your bag um, it might be easier maybe to flip the yeah the angle and then there we go so here's your bag <laughs> the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your bag and you're gonna fold over the edge so that you have a nice little lip right there like that Ta -da. Ta -da. <laughs> um, and that's gonna help with stability it's also gonna um, eliminate some of the extra room that you just don't need in the back then you are going to take a cup or a spoon or any sort of scoop that you have on hand thank you Tanya um, and you're gonna transfer this soil into your bag so um, this is a little bit tricky in the wind so bear with me but we're not gonna be mad at the wind. We're really grateful for the wind. It's part of Mother Earth and it's part of the entire reseeding process. So you're just gonna kind of fill your bag up. You'll see the wind's kind of taking some of my soil, but that's okay. As you fill, you're just gonna kind of shake it down and keep on filling. You're gonna shake it down to have it settle a little bit more um, so that we get a nice full bag. You don't have to and you don't want to fill it all the way to the lip. You just have to fill it a little below and we're going to shake it down. And as you do this, shake it, don't break it. Shake it, don't break it. And you're <laughs> going to um, pinch the corners a little bit and that's going to help create a nice flat bottom so that when you have them standing on their own, um, they can do that. Look at that. Way to go, Aww. Kit. Way to go, little plant bag. All right, so I'm going to fill it up just a little bit more. And remember to let it settle a little bit. And there we go. So you have your first bag prepped and ready for planting.